if you're watching this video, your slasher can dunk, I promise you. There's hope for him. So don't give up yet, don't make a new mod player. But before I tell you how, nine new people subscribe to me. Hello to all nine of you. We're gonna make big things happen in the future, I promise. Right here, I'm just showing I have a 99 contact dunk, so it'll be easy for me to dunk on somebody since I'm a pure player. If you have a pure player, you already know you get a 99 contact dunk. Even if you have a dual archetype, your contact dunks should be high if you have the driving and finishing first and whatever else second. Now, if you watch this video, you're not guaranteed to dunk on everybody every time you feel like dunking on them, so don't get mad at me if your slasher isn't dunking on Jesus, but like this will help you. The first thing I want you to try is upgrade your ball handling, your vertical, your speed, and your acceleration. Because the faster you're driving to the paint, the more likely you are to get a contact dunk. So upgrade everything that involves speed if you can. And then also if you can, you obviously want to max out your dunk so you can get the highest contact dunk possible. Now this might sound obvious, but the second thing you want to do is make sure you have your dunks equipped. Now on 2K17, they already had your dunks equipped, but on this game it's different. I played about 20 games with no dunks on at all because I thought that they just have them on like 2K17 did. This part right here is for people who don't know how to put on their contact dunks. If you do, you can skip it. But what you wanna do is you wanna press triangle and then go over to the My Player Lab and click on that. Now you're gonna load in here and you just wanna go down to Equip Animations. When you go to Equip Animations, you wanna go up to Gameplay Moves. And then when you go to Gameplay Moves, you wanna go to Dunks and Layups. And then when you go to Dunks and Layups, click on NBA. And then just click all of them on that you have because I didn't have any of this stuff on. It said none on all of them. And then at the bottom, that's where your contact dunks are. So if you have them, then make sure you have them on too. They're just at the bottom. Now when you're actually trying to get posterized, you're gonna run into people who play defense like this. They stand real far back. So when you do the size up and you try to run past them, they just run straight into you. But you just keep running back and then you do the little size up again. And then you can run past them and dunk on them like that. Now before I did all those steps I mentioned earlier in the video, my dude did this right here. He would run in and pull up like that. Sometimes he would even do step backs and pull up. Most of the time he did little layups like this, but this is where I'm gonna tell you how I start dunking on people. It's really about all where you jump from. Now when I dunk on people, I hold the right stick back away from the rim. Now this is just a different angle, but this is usually where I hold the right stick back at. As you can see right here, this is where I hold the right stick back do the contact dunk. This is literally the sweet spot for getting any contact dunk. If you hold it right there, like right before he crosses that line right there, then you will almost dunk on him every time, I promise you. And here's just another one, you know, you gotta do a little size up, run in, and then you dunk from about right there. And I'm gonna show it in slow motion right here again. But you just run in, and then right when you get to that little sweet spot, you hold the right stick away from the rim, and he should dunk on him. And if he doesn't dunk on him, then I don't know what else to tell you. I mean, you can ask me questions, I'll try to answer more of them. But if you can't dunk on them by doing all the steps I just told you, then I really don't know what to tell you anymore. Like I said before, if you had any questions, comment, and I'll answer them. I'll probably make a video about it because it's just easier to make a video sometimes. But just comment your questions, and I'll try to help you. But if this doesn't help you, then I honestly don't even know what to say because this is the way I got posterizers. This is the way I got my contact dunks. And it shouldn't even matter how high your contact dunk is because my dude was dunking in the prelude. But anyway, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Welcome to the six new people, and I'll see you guys in the next video.